Like, babe, listen, I don't ever want to get a divorce. The f did you say? I'm going to tell you how I believe that I've continued to scale is, is Austin, I never changed back. Dude, I'm watching people burn themselves to the ground. I li we literally just told everybody the blueprint how to not burn yourself to the ground. 100%. You say a lot of controversial stuff, according to the world. But when I listen to you talk, I hear a lot of truth. Mm -hmm. So w why do you think the world thinks of it as controversial? Because they don't want to hear the truth. Mm. Listen, if you were going out and drinking and I told you to stop drinking because I think that you could do, I think you could do more in revenue and business. And I think, you know how you're going to the gym, right? Yeah. Yeah, cool. Hey, what if I told you that you would have way better results if you stopped drinking altogether and give it up because your body would actually respond better because you wouldn't be drinking and, and keep restarting. Mm-hmm. Right? Would that be negative of me? No. No, but if truth. I tell you to stop drinking, guess what? People are like, who are you to tell me what to do? Ego and pride. Uh, yeah. How old are you? I'm 29. Yeah, yeah. I'm 29 years old, bro. Mm -hmm. I got my own business. Okay. I'm pretty freaking successful. And here you are telling me I can't have a drink. I think I've earned a drink. Whoa. Okay. Mm -hmm. My bad. Yep. Looks like someone's maxed out. Yeah. Looks like someone doesn't want to grow. Okay, I ask people all the time. I say, hey, let me ask you a question, Austin. Where do you think you are right now? Scale one to 10. Mm -hmm. One being the worst, 10 being the best. People, people say, say, people say, I'm an eight, I'm a nine. Okay, cool. So you're pretty much maxed out. You don't really have any more room to grow. Is that what you're saying? Mm. They're like, no, dude, I got a lot of room to go. Oh, so you're not maxed out. So you're saying you're like a two. Your two may be better than someone else's 10, but you're a two compared to your 10. Is that right? Sure, yeah. Cool. Number one, I just closed you, you're a two. A minute ago, you said you were a nine. So it just shows you how good I am at closing. I frame the whole thing. But number two, it shows you that people think they're an eight or a nine when really I'm a one. If you were to ask me, Andy, where are you at one to 10? I'm a one. And when I hit my 10, I'm taking over the whole world. Yeah. So like, I'm a one. Like I got so much to learn. Everyone that I talk to, I got something to learn. Everyone that I run into has something to teach me. Everywhere I go, do listen. I think God made people in this world that aren't gonna be successful so they can show us if we don't get our shit together, what that's gonna look like. Mm. Let me say that again. Yep. There's people that I believe are in this world that aren't going to listen to the truth. They're going to stay the same. And those people are an example for me to look at daily so I can remind myself what will happen the minute I decide to be undisciplined, break my routine, and not keep my word to myself mm -hmm. and lower my standards. So I'm thankful that there's people like that. I just don't want to be one. And I used to be one. Yeah. The one to 10 thing is interesting. It's correct me if I'm wrong. It's basically humility versus ego and pride. Ego is right? the death of everything. Mm -hmm. Yep. Ego is the death of a marriage. Look, you got guys out here in mm -hmm. your company. One of them can mess up today. They could do something that costs a hundred grand. Yeah. And you go out there. They're, they're one of your top guys. They love you. They didn't mean to do anything wrong. You go out there. The end of your fate is at the end of your anger. You run out there and you're like, hey, dude, what the hell, man? What's going on? All of a sudden, this guy was loyal to you. He saw that when he made a mistake, you don't have any grace on him. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You know, like, and then what happens? Resentment creeps in. He's like, dude, I don't like Austin no more. I can't believe that. I didn't mean to do that. You know that my heart's good. I didn't mean to make that happen. But you go and you say something really out of, out of line. You know what I'm saying? Yep. And that's what people do when they're mad. They say, they say, they, they say that they can't take back. And, uh, you know, it's like a husband and wife when they say the divorce word, mm. right? Like, babe, listen, I don't ever want to get a divorce. The f did you say? Yeah. Why'd you even bring it up? Like, like when that happens, that relationship will never be the same. Yep. Super important, guys. If you're watching this video right now and you're like, Andy, I'm not built like that. Bullshit. Yes, you are. Okay, Got to train. That's the way it works. Train or complain, it's your choice. Okay, every day I train the greatest in the world. You know what I mean? Are you ready to kick some ass and build your legacy and make history? If you are, in the description box below on this YouTube video, there's gonna be a little link. You click on it, enter your phone number, email, full name, and I will personally reach out to you in the next 24 hours. If you're serious about kicking some ass, going to the new level, recreating, next version of yourself, I'm your guy. Let's kill it. It'll never be the same. If you were to say to that employee, listen, if you wanna always work here, like, oh, like there's a day that, see, you yeah. wanted me to be loyal to you forever and you're going to make mistakes and you're going to screw up decisions in this company and things are going to change here, but I'm going to need to show you grace, but you won't show me any when I mess up. Do listen, man, there's this thing that's like, I call like the standard that you raise in yourself that allows you to just, you know, like understand why yeah. people burn their businesses to the ground. 
Dude, I'm watching people burn their marriages to the ground. Dude, I'm watching people burn themselves to the ground. I've li we've literally just told everybody the blueprint how to not burn yourself to the ground. 100%. No question. And, and by the way, if you do what we say, I don't know how the next dot aligns, whether it's the business you're in right now, like it's going to ex explode. But I know if you become this person that we've talked about this whole time on this podcast, someone will walk up and put their hand out and shake your hand and they're going to freaking need you to be with them. And that thing is going to be really big. Mm. Don't look at your situation now and go, well, how, if I do this, can my situation be better? No. How about when I become me, mm. the situation gets better. That's why I say like, bro, like Jim Rohn, which is Tony Robbins mentor. Like he always says, like, don't wish it was easier. Wish you were better. Like, like in the Bible, it says the old is gone. The new has come. Like, dude, like we're so stupid. Mm -hmm. It's not a strategy. Now, when you start to become like elite and you start to keep your word and you start to do all these things right and you raise your standards, now you add strategies in and holy shit, bro, you're blown up. And I think that's why we're blown up so big yeah. because honestly, I had to become who I needed to become for all these strategies that I was learning to actually even really manifest. You think that's also the key to building culture? Bro, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, dude, listen, man. If you're not who you tell me I can become, I don't believe I can become it. Right. And by the way, leaders don't live by double standards. You know who builds an environment? A leader. Yep. Yeah. So I, I'm all about human capital. I'm all about people. There's inventory, there's marketing, there's buildings. But then there's people. Mm -hmm. Dude, I'm in the people space. I build people. That's all I build. I, I, I don't know about anything about marketing, okay? I mean, maybe we're okay at it. I really don't even talk about it a lot. I don't, I don't have any inventory. I sell knowledge. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I'm telling you, I'm in the people deal. And your mind is your greatest weapon. And it's a piece of real estate. And, and you're the gatekeeper. Mm -hmm. And, like, you have the opportunity right now to delete everything in your head and become a new person. Or you can stay the same. Yeah. And by the way, oh, this is an important one because I don't know where we're at on time, but I want to say something. Never unchange. Never unchange. That's, that's the secret. Mm -hmm. So anybody that's watching this, they're like, oh, I'm going to change. I'm going to tell you how I believe that I've continued to scale is, is Austin, I never changed back. So like we have to note that. Yep. Like I never changed back. I never went back. Most people change, but then they stop and they change back. My superpower is I never change back. Mm. So I think anybody that's learning anything right now is that what I'm going to tell you is never change back. Once you kill off the old you, that, that you is not allowed to come back anymore. Yeah. Hey guys, looks like you made it to the end of the video. You're the true point zero zero zero. One percenters. Look, I know one percenters, it can make it halfway through the video, but making it all the way through, you guys are the best. Now, here's what I'd like to do. Number one, I want to get closer to you. The fact that you made it all the way through the video, you're like, man, dude, I want to roll with this guy. Okay, so I need to connect with you. Down below, there's a description box on this YouTube video. There's a link. It says coach with me one-on-one, -on -one, okay? If you'll go and you'll enter your information, I'll reach out to you in the next 24 hours. You can tell me what you need help with, what your goals are, and we will crush it together. I would love to help you guys go to the next level in life. You can tell I'm changing my life really fast, and I know that you guys want the same thing. I'd love to go with you on that journey. So right now, if you'd like to partner with me, team with me, if you want me to help coach you and push you, everybody needs a coach, a higher level of accountability to go to the next level. Go to the description box below, click on the link, fill out your information. I'll talk to you in the next 24 hours. Let's kill it.